Hey guys and girls, this is Gordon Overkill with another run of Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. So, let's name our character this time... Um, Hans. Hans shall be the first winner that is not a Minotaur Berserker in my personal career and ever play another pretty easy race class combination. A Hill Orc Fighter, wearing, wielding a war axe. So, that's what I'll try to win with. The Hillock Fighter is not the most difficult uh, <laughs> race class combination, but uh, I'm also not good enough to win with the <laughs> rather difficult ones. I just watched a video where Demise, uh, the YouTuber, won with a Feel It Venom Mage, which is totally insane. <laughs> uh, that always shows how much space there is for improvement. Anyways, uh, I'd rather play this <laughs> easy guy here and hope that I uh, get that done. Or to so, such a tough game. It's all about the game knowledge, about uh, playing carefully, and, uh, well, I hope that at one point I'll also progress to the bit uh, more difficult race classes. And that looks pretty well here. We already got two rings and an amulet. As soon as we got a bit more um, mm, scrolls, I will, I will equip them and hope that it's something nice among them. Also that... Um, um, wait, I lost my three shields. Also, that uh, chainmail is pretty cool. We already got nine points of protection value. That leaves us pretty safe for the uh, early game, I think. If we're not really unlucky with uh, with uh, with the monster spawns. Okay, I'll pick that up. Maybe we'll find a blowgun. With the Hill Orc, we can play the early game a bit quicker than I usually try to do, just because he's absolutely OP. Already got five scrolls, different ones, six different ones. As soon as we've got, let's say, eight different scrolls, then I will uh, equip the, the accessoires that we found. Seven. <laughs> okay, one more. It's almost enough. Pretty sure that there is a room of curse among it. Chances are pretty high at least. Okay, this guy is dangerous. Luckily we could kill him. A lot of poison needles and a plate armor. Excellent. Uh, that's our armor for quite a while until we find some sh something magical. Wait, that nice little cat of mine just opened the door and it's getting a bit freezy in here, frosty. So ah, now let's continue. Okay, it's a cursed plate armor, but I don't mind. I, I want to wear that for a while, anyways. Good, good. Down to dungeon level 3. Uh. <coughs> For a lot of weaker race classes, um, weaker characters, this, uh, these poisonous enemies are super deadly. Maybe I should play it a bit more carefully anyways, but uh, we've got 39 hit, hitch points already, which is really good. That's the Shining One, that's Cybriados, okay, maybe later. I intend to um, choose Okabaru as my god. Uh, Trok is practically Berserker, I don't want to do that again, but Okabaru, Okabaru is, uh, he is known to be pretty powerful for melee characters and I definitely want a winner with Okabao. So if we get an altar, that's gonna be our deity of choice. That's two more corpses, but here we've got a hand axe of freezing. 
if that is even enchanted, plus one. It has eight base damage, and that's three less, but it has the freezing property. I think I'll stay with I think I'll stay with the war axe. Uh, how much quicker is it? It has um zero point six at fourteen. This one has zero point seven at sixteen. I think I'll take the small X for the moment at least. Okay, we're done with level three. Level four is the next. We didn't find any scrolls in the last level though, so I think on level five I will read my scrolls anyway. So at least then we will find out. That's a friendly little guy. <coughs> Ouch, that hurt. So, here is the temple, and where is Okabaru? I see truck, and there is Okabaru, perfect. So, from now on, we are religious chopper of Okabaru. That's the eighth scroll that I wanted. I, I'll just finish this level and on the next level. Okay, that's a bit dangerous. Let's retreat around that corner and now quickly kill him. Oh fuck! Kill him! Kill him! Oh, kill! Ah! Whew! Close, close. Strength. Can we kill the phantom? Or is that too dangerous? He does one point of damage. Oh my god! Might die here. Okay, okay. Time to read the scrolls now. At first, equip the stuff. Gormon, cool. Protection from magic, cool. Ice, well, uh, situation and the cool. So, retreat. Okay, he follows us. That's not so nice. Oh, fuck. Uh, we are in a bit of trouble. I hope that's teleportation. It was a scroll of teleportation. Yes, now we just have to stay alive until it kicks in. Oh, we're poisoned. Fuck. Um, that's maybe curing. Yeah, that was curing. Very good, and we got out. That was a dangerous situation. Holy moly. Okay, play more carefully. Lesson learned. But first, let's um. Try to find out what the rest of our scrolls do. Identify. This is a potion of brilliance. Identify this potion. Flight. Degeneration. That's good to know. Lignification. Drop the degeneration one. Um, and this is a scroll of fear. Remove curse. So we know that at least. Amnesia. Recharging. We don't have a wand though. And fuck. Okay, we don't know the uh, improvement thingies yet. Can we kill this guy? I think now we should be able to kill him. Let's let's eat the beef jerky though quickly. Yep, now he's dead. <coughs> quickly rush through these guys. A garment is oh fuck pain. Mm. I brought the potion of might and hope he doesn't cast pain again. Yeah, good. Quickly killed him. That was not bad. That's a pretty tough level so far. Blanc the orc. I think we can easily kill Blanc. I'm not afraid of him. Oh, but if an ogre comes from behind, uh, that makes it a lot more unpleasant. Okay, killed them both. Good. Just brute force. Tough level, like I said, tough level. Wand of fire, okay, that's something. And we are engorged. Pretty cool. Uh. Done with this level. Let's go downstairs. So we have got magic mapping, but we don't need it for this level. Okay. Teleport trap. I 
which is eight. Shield seven. That's cool. Okay, that could be close. Should better retreat. I don't know. I hope we can kill him. Wait a second. I'd rather take the other X for this fight. Yeah, that's better. So of course, this guy was resistant to cold. Rotten, but thanks. I will stay true to my axes. Orcs have such a good aptitude with axes that it would be not a good idea to change that. Okay. Uh, got him. Got him. Identify. Cool. There's a new scroll that's blinking. Let's blink up to that scroll. That's enchant weapon. I use that on the mm, on the war axe. That's our weapon in the long term. This is agility. Okay. There comes Guido. Guido looks a bit dangerous. The hill orc fighter of Okavaro. Guido is probably stronger than us. Hmm. Yeah, I think he is. So let's just learn way kill this guy first. Uh, no, I'll give it a try. Heroism and see if we can now kill Guido. Maybe I'll also drink agility. And we definitely need the other axe against him. Yeah, that was a good hit. We can kill him? Yeah, yeah, we got him. Nice. Yeah, that's our advantage. We can use uh we can use uh, our uh divine abilities. He cannot Ouch. It hurt. Got ten in excess now. It's getting there. It's getting there. Almost nine and shields. Maybe now? No, not yet. That shields nine. Good. We need fifteen shields and we need uh sixteen excess. That's the aim. Teleportation. Good to have. Ordinary shield, we already have exactly the same. <coughs> Fuck. If somebody invisible attacks us, that will be helpful. Ah, oh, I forgot something on the on the on the higher level. What was it? The um, didn't I see a ah the pair of gloves? Yeah, that was it. Let's go there and get it. Just remember that I saw something on the ground. Yeah, very good. 12 points of protection value now, of armor class. That's not bad, not bad. Prince Ribbit. Prince Ribbit tends to be pretty strong, but um, I think he uh, is a reptile, so our freezing axe should work pretty well against him. I think we can kill him. Yeah, good, 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 good. And we got him. You've reached level 9. Strength. 10.8 axis, almost 11. Home of curse, good to have. Kill him. Yeah. Nice. A nice supply of curing already, and we're done with the sixth level. Let's see what level seven has to offer for us. First, somebody corrodes our equipment, which kind of sucks. Luckily, we can fight these uh, casters one by one and not all together in a big open room. 
two priests. That would have been really dangerous otherwise. Shields level 10. Cool. <sighs> Identify. Nice. The more the better. That's haste. Emergency escape tour. What did he use? Um, he throws an exploding tomahawk. Uh -huh. Priest, priest. Okay, I'll wait for them. I'll wait for them. Oh fuck. Okay, good. We could get them all at once. That was uh, a bit lucky, or um, definitely the positioning was in our favor. Second time we had a really da dangerous orc band and had a little luck to get through there. Second ring of uh, protection from magic. I'll equip that for the moment. There's two slots of magic protection. Not bad. Helps against these priests. Um, it's an ordinary one. No thanks. It's good that we've got a shield that helps against centaurs or ranged fighters in general. And we're done with the seventh level. No lair and mines yet, though. I think the lair could already be here, could it? No, eight is the first level where it can appear. Oh, yes, they do so much damage. So much damage. Kill the priest quickly. Good, good. Kill them all. Good. Already got a war axe. In Asia, I don't think that we'll ever need that, but if it's laying there, no reason not to take it. Uh, hand axe of flaming. That's maybe better. Yeah, yeah. I'll keep both for the moment, but uh, that's a potential weapon against hydras in the lair, which is definitely useful. Shields level eleven. Cool. Gamma scrolls are these. At first, check the potion magic with a random uselessness. We can drop that. And that's noise. Okay. Drop the random uselessness. Never again pick up noise. Oh, Hydra. Can we already kill a Hydra? Heroism. Uh, hmm. We have got a flaming axe. Luckily, we just found that. Okay, there it is. Let's fight. Heroism, and see how we do. Chop off the heads. Three headed Hydra. Two headed Hydra. I think we can kill it. One head, and it's dead. Good. Luckily. I'm a bit afraid of that Hydra. 13 in excess now. We're getting there, we're getting there. Um, let's just check. Yeah, it's really 14 for this one and uh, 16 for the war axe. This is 15. Quickly go up here and scout the remaining pieces. Ouch, kill him, good. 
to take out Venom. What a nasty weapon. And continue. This guy is absolutely immune to colds. It's a fire, so let's swap to the cold axe. That works better. Get a gift. Usually the first gift is something pretty useless. This time the rune morning star. No, I stay with axes. I don't care about rune morning stars. <coughs> Although we of course have got a couple of um, um, a couple of levels and flails <laughs> because it cross trains with axes. Fuck a giant heroism. And there he goes. Excellent. Good job. X is level 14. <coughs> Wonder Flame. Cool. And we still didn't find the lair. No. Let's go down to 9. A null pack. Can we lure them up one by one? That's good. Good. Okay, that's two nodes at once. Oh, it's not so good. But I can get one up with me, that's perfect. Just that sky beast. Can we quickly kill this guy? Yeah. And now that guy. Nice. Find a buckler, but now that a shield is already level 12.4, I don't want to use a buckler anymore. We found that earlier, I would have used that for a while. Now, nope. Use the cold X for this little devil. And back to the fire X. We have level 14, so we've got maximum speed with our small axes now. I'll aim for level 16 though. Blinking, good. Let's identify. And the other one, not sure. I'll wait for the yaks first though. Oh my god. Good tweet. Here we fight. Heroism, I said heroism. Level 11, good. Kill this guy. Kill that guy. That's an enchanted war axe that looks pretty interesting to me. No, yeah, let's use that right now. It's a plus three war axe. We can drop the plus one one. I think I'll keep the hand axe a bit longer. Until we reach level 16 in uh, thingy dingy cure mutation, cool. Heal wounds, three times heal wounds, wow. Let's check out this ring. Ring of wizardry, nope, thanks. It's magic mapping, let's again identify. Oh, we didn't have potions left, so let's identify the wand of fire. I think that's better than wand of flame. 11 casting points, not bad. Check out this ring. Ring of fire, uh, maybe for situations, but not always. Okay, that was some damage. 13 in shields, almost 15 in axes. Mm -hmm, got a good weapon against him already. We do not need a rune leather armor. That's not heavy enough for our own ambition. We are the guy with the big uh, with the big armor. Kill him. Good. 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 Mm. Another enchanted war axe. Ok, 
give it a try. Oh, remove cursed. A troll. Trolls are pretty strong. I use heroism for that fight. And down he goes. New scroll, uh huh. Hand of Orcs, identify. Read the new scroll. Torment, ah, shit. Anyways, now we know it. <coughs> Got the priest. Got them all. At that's the moment when you realize that you're playing a pretty strong uh, race class combination when you can just tap through pretty tough groups. That's uh, an Orc Wizard. That's not nice. Okay, but he dies. Good. Uh oh. Don't let them surround me. Kill them. Heroism. We are slowed. Why? Teleportation. It's getting dangerous. We still got heroism, so I hope we can kill him. Yeah, got him. <sighs> Goes a bit too close for my taste. She is 33. 101v1 him. We destroy the wraith. Very good. Stare dance a bit longer here, longer here, just so we don't have to fight too many at once. Ouch. Gift, good. What is that gift? Ah, oh, Tomahawk of Returning. Well, why not? Why not? We can throw a Tomahawk at our enemies. Throw, 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 kill. Maybe it can soften them up a bit from distance. I doubt that it's gonna be really useful, but anyways. Let's get arrows of dispersal. Good. Luckily, we got dispersed pretty close to him. Took down the yaks. Uh, got him. Short sort of electrolution. Holy cow. Not nice. We are already on level 10. We didn't find orcs, nor did we find uh, the lair yet. Already got glass. That's not magical, no. Scroll of Identify and another amulet. I'll stay with my amulet, though. Kind of like garment. Maybe we can identify the other one later. For now. Got one potion, that's Berserk Rage, cool, and uh, the Ruby Amulet is Amulet of Warding. Aha. Uh -huh. What ring is this? Sustain attributes? Nope. But we directly equip the Ring of Cold because that's Fana. Ring of Cold, Heroism, and Attack. He can take a lot of fact. Uh, hey, stop that. Drains the heat from his surroundings. He disappears. Where did he go to? 
Dude, show yourself. Still alive. Almost had him, and then he teleported away and fled. I will search him on this level though. Somewhere you are. Ah, got him. Heroism. Ouch. I should have used heroism from the beginning of the battle. Now kill him. Yes, got him. Axis 16, that means we have got our minimum delay that we wanted for the war axe. Let's use that from now on, I think it just does a lot more damage. Did you drop anything useful? Nope. Unequip the ring though. Back to the... Oh, Silly. I think Silly was not that strong. Spare Bearer, Centaur, Fighter of Okabaru. I think we should be able to kill Silly pretty easily. Maybe not. Wait. Heroism. She does some damage. I think that Silly was not that strong. Come on, kill. Yeah, good. And we're done here. Down to level 11. Still no lair. A wave of frost passes over us, and that's a lot of enemies. I just go to another downstairs. I want to know where the wave of frost came from. Down there? No, that's where we first were. Is it here? There's the lair entrance. Finally found that. And here is the frost branch. Is there an upstairs closer to that? No, not too far closer. Just a little bit. So I think we can just keep it like that. Yeah, good. Kill this guy. I hate these big rooms where you cannot. Hide in a corridor, or hardly. Good, got them all. Here is the orc entrance, so finally we've got it all. We've got orc, we've got lair, and we've got this frost place that we can visit now. Oh fuck, heroism. Oh fuck! Teleportation. Oh, fuck. Got him. Oh, no. Oh, no. Have we got blinking? Blink right next to the... Oh, no! Got him. Got one more blinking. Uh, no, we had heal wounds. Oh fuck! How could I forget that? Oh, uh, that was close. Not very well played by me. So let's try to get down there now. Oh my god! Fuck you. Where's the closest staircase? Here. Are the upstairs? Downstairs? There. 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 Is that one? Try to get there. Oh, and a priest. Fuck you all. Get up here. Kill the both of them. And maybe we won't get the, the frost thingy, but we have to regenerate now. I was too greedy. I definitely wanted that, and. Uh, we almost died. Have to kill the priest. How many priests are there on this level? Unbelievable. Killer bees. Got something nice here. Enchant weapon, maybe. And nothing that we really need. Kill the bees. Glowing large shield. I'll try that out. 
No, not keep this rolling. There must still be something. Oh, a Brotex. Cool. Still poisoned. Kind of sucks a bit. Can we reach it? In time? Fuck you. Have to kill that demonologist as quickly as possible. We don't do any damage though. Let's craft one portion of heal wounds. And now Berserk. I think that's worth here. Good, got him. Now kill all the ice beasts behind us. Good. And get in here. <coughs> I really wanted that ice place because I knew we had extra resistance with the Ring of Frost. And we've got an extra fire which maybe does extra damage against them. Uh, I'll try out this one quickly. Broad X of Electrolution. So I'll definitely drop this. How much do we need for the Broad X? 18. We get there quickly. I think we can also drop this. I'm never gonna use that. Broad of X of Electrolution is perfect. That's maybe the the best non-artifact weapon for a um for a a one-handed X fighter. Okay, retreat, retreat. Come on, frosty devils, kill them. Cool, we got the first one. Regenerate. Yeah, but now time is not a problem anymore. Now that we are in here, can just ah. Uh, okay, get back. Regenerate. That was a bit of damage. Yeah, now we get him. So nice. Some tough enemies. Kill the simulacrums. Kill this guy. Nice, nice, nice. We're already 15 in shields. That's enough, isn't it? I wanted to try out this shit. Large shield of poison resistance. Wow, that needs 25. <laughs> uh. Not now. Wait. How quickly do we attack when we have that 0.7 to 0.9? That's okay. That's okay. I I keep that. I will stop increasing that though. We need more fighting now. Zero point seven to zero point nine is absolutely okay for a poison resistance and a large shield that gives us twenty two points of shield. Kill him. Ah good, that gives us a gift. Broad X. We just put a lot of points into uh into into shields and we've got a very good weapon of electrolution. I don't think I will use the broad axe. Quickly kill this guy. Nice, let's see what we get. Curing Rune Demon Whip, not for this character. Recharging Rune War X could be an idea. Rune Battle X could be an idea. I wanna try out these weapons. Battle axe of Electrolution, okay. <laughs> okay, and that's a uh, war axe of venom. And this is a battle axe of venom. I dropped the battle axe of venom, I drop the war axe of venom, I think. Yeah, there's no situation where I'll use that over the electrolution broad axe. Mm, I also dropped the battle axe, yeah. I want to keep the shield, I like the shield. So, we're done here, so let's leave.
that was definitely worth though. Okay, a giant deserves heroism. Same with the two headed ogre. Now we kinda slaughter a chip through their ranks like a like a beast. Scorpion is near, okay. Ordinary ogres are nothing to be afraid of anymore. Yeah, actually, slowly but surely, I'm feeling really strong. I'll buy the enchant weapon scroll, I think. Maybe. No, I buy the potions. One black potion. And the enchant weapon scroll. I want to really want to enchant the weapon. Identify the potion. It's poison, okay, not worth. And uh, enchant broad axe. Drop the poison. You don't smite me, thanks. I think I will drop the, the tomahawks. I'm never going to use them. Kill the bees. Nice drop. That was some damage though. I think for the moment it's okay if I take this so and this so and put the biggest part on fighting. I think that's maybe the best thing to do with my experience at the moment. I want to get shields up. I can have Electrolution? Nope. I want to get my access skill to maximum at one point, so I'll do it like that. Would just be a waste not to put points into a skill with such a killer aptitude. Of course, we don't have to be afraid of these archers at all. And we're done here. So, what's our next aim? We won't go deeper into the main dungeon, but... Lair or Orc? I think Orc might be easier with this character. On the other hand, we also have... No, 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 let's go to Lair first. So. Where is it? Here. And this is a nice point to end the first episode. So guys, thanks to all of you for watching. Um, I hope to see you again in the next episode. Until then, bye everybody.